this year at the Ball 1000 we had qualifying, so the challenge we had was is it's actually in the middle of nowhere. Ended up setting up a satellite dish and we were able to set up a commercial grade network. We were able to utilize the cubes along with the bolts. We have a three camera setup going today. At our finish line, we have a Replay XD hooked up to a cube encoder. At the start line, we have a GoPro connected to a cube. And we also have a bolt on a red Epic here on the jump. All three cameras are hitting the production switcher then outputting live via satellite connection. Our production truck is actually further away from the start than it was last year. So the hurdle with that is running cables is almost impossible. So what we utilized is the, the Teradek cubes and was able to put a camera where we could actually get all the action of the start. Normally we have only the cameras on the podium. This way we were able to show cameras in the first turn, cameras at the start. We could have cameras wherever we want them. And what we're doing this year, it's a little different from last year, is we have a jumbotron that uh, we're actually utilizing a bolt to transmit the video signal from our production switcher wirelessly to the screen, which is actually quite a distance away, which has worked amazingly. Running cables is just no bueno in Mexico. Wireless is going to be the way we go. We're definitely going to be working with Teradek, which is officially Baja proven. Step up our quality, they stepped up our camera placements. We're actually getting cameras placed with thousands and thousands of spectators and very remote places. The Teradex allow us to get those cameras in those places where we would never be able to do it before. Teradex, great company that we got together with this year and uh, very fortunate to have them out here at the thousand. Things that were done here today that have never been done in the history of off-road racing.